I might even like this more than Fenty. <gasps> Welcome back to my channel. Um, happy first of the year. This is the first video of 2023. Yay! And today we are going to be reviewing, I'm so late, Rare Beauty products um, and just Rare Beauty as a brand. I'm like super late. However, okay, I like it when I get a variety of products. Like I want all the skin products. I, I just do. That's my, my that's my jam. And I wanted to do a, just a, a smidgen of research. Not enough to like sway me this way or that way, but just nothing. You know, I'm an Alex Russo fan. Like I'm a Selena Gomez. I I, I I like her. I was a heavy Fenty Beauty stan. Still am. Still love Fenty Beauty. And that's all I've been getting is Fenty Beauty products because why would I not? But I was like, let me explore a little bit. Let me get along with the world. Without further ado, let's get into this video. All right, guys. So my face is already primed and prepped. Let me get my coffee. Before I get into anything crazy, let me pull out the receipt and tell you guys everything that I got and how much it was, okay? I got the Always Optimist spray, so like the setting spray, I got it for $27. I got the Matte Lipid, Matte Lipid, Matte Lip Liner, $15. I got the Positive Light, it's like a glowifying, it's like a highlighter that was for $25. I got the concealer, which was $22. And then, then I got the matte lipstick for $20. It all went up to $109. But Illinois State tax is 9.75%, which added on $10.63. Cook County in Illinois, they're not playing with us, okay? So everything, my total amount was $119 cents yeah packaging though like the packaging I'm such a sucker for it I like I'm here for the packaging it's so like clean and granted I'm a millennial and somehow some way we keep the boxes for everything so I'm gonna try really hard not to keep the boxes okay enough talking and swatching let's just put everything on I'm a little warm today, like it's, Midwest temperatures are a little crazy. Yes, I have on my cute little bonnet because we're deep conditioning, but you know, we can still have a cute face while we're deep conditioning. So let's get started with concealer. Now, <laughs> for the girls who know, like let me just tell y'all, unless I'm going somewhere specifically, I do not put on foundation. Like I will use my concealer as foundation. I, it's a game changer, that's all I'm gonna say. So let's put this on. I'm just gonna put it right onto my prepped and primed skin. Okay. All right. Oh, I love the flatness right there. Come through, Alex Russo, come through. As you guys see, I'm not like dipping in anymore. Which showing she got a lot of product on oh, here. Yeah. Right. Put a little bit right there. And we're just gonna slice it through right here. I love to get all the highlights into place. And then we're gonna dip it in a little bit more. You guys do not into these products because like to any products. All you're doing is putting more air bu bubbles into them and they're going to expire a lot sooner than they're supposed to because you're pumping all that air in there. So don't do that. Even for your lip gloss, just don't do it. It's not good for the product. 
and I'm just gonna, since it's concealer, I'm just gonna put it on a couple little spots. I need a little extra concealing. I didn't watch too many videos on this product or any of the Rare Beauty products, but what from what I have seen, Selena's Rare Beauty seems to be for the girls who don't want to put on a lot of makeup. Like, they just don't. They want to be my skin but better, and that's perfect for me because that's all I do. So with an e.l.f. brush, I'm just gonna go in. It was very light. That much I noticed immediately. Not like light in color, but light in application. You just tap, 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 tap. I like the way that finishes. It's not intense coverage at all um so for you high glam girls and guys all of y'all you may or may not be okay with this um it's very model off duty yeah i'm for this i'm definitely for this like do you guys see the the illumination then we're gonna go in with my sponge just to get up in here i don't like putting a brush that close to my eyes With the back of the sponge just kind of just in case i have any streaks it doesn't look like i have any streaks but just in case yeah and as you guys are kind of seeing the match is still matching okay yeah that finish is so pretty okay yeah i'm for it i'm for it like this finish is just and i have texture on my face like that's just what a face is but it's not like it's not hindering me any type of way this is pretty but i'm going to add a smidgen of blush my favorite part um i'm gonna put it up here Cause my cheek is right there but i like it when it's a little little something i'm gonna put a dot right there because i think that's cute put that there and i'm just going to use my same brush that i use for my concealer and to just and for a splash of extra color I'm also going to put it on my eye. Just all around in this area. Yeah, you see that? Just gorgeous. Yeah. Yeah. Ugh. And doesn't this just give? Like, you guys. <laughs> First of all, the glow like do you see this luminous glassy look and it's dry here okay we're in the continent of dryness out here in the midwest but not today baby and i'm gonna take my sponge and just diffuse a little bit my sponge is already stained because I got the brilliant idea when I first put on the blush to do it with the sponge. Horrible idea. I just put the blush on the sponge. Horrible idea. Don't do what I did, kids. And then to add on to that, let's reflect. Oh, I'm gonna try not to OD on this. I'm gonna put it right. Oh, I don't even need to glow. Like, your girl's already glowing. But, you know, and we're gonna put it right here, right here. And then right, 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 right here. And then right here. <laughs> These products are gonna last me forever because I use so little. 
either way we're just gonna bounce it on the back and I'm just gonna really play with it into the blush Cause listen, cause listen. Mm -mm. Excuse the shadows on my face. It looks kind of funny right now, but mm. Okay, so I did my lashes and I powdered down a little bit. Um, I just used my Ilia mascara and my, huh, back to the OG's original airspun powder to just kind of pat it down. I did not, obviously, I want to lose the glow. Like, I, I like looking a little dewy, but you know. Here's what it's looking like. It doesn't look like what it looks like on camera. Like in person, I just look super illuminated and pretty. But the way I have the lighting set up for you guys right now, and the way my tripod has broken, and so I'm trying to like get things together. Listen. But either way, <laughs> let's set this makeup. <laughs> If you don't OD with your setting spray, like, have you really set, like... <sighs> I could spray that all day long and I get sick of it. It's dangerous. Like, it's, it's dangerous. But do you guys see what it did for the face? And then just to make sure it really embeds, I'm just gonna tap very lightly. So anyway, I'm gonna get my lip pencil. And again, this is in the color Gifted. She's a, she's like a brown, but she's got some red to her. Um, very muted though, very pretty. And let's just, the glide. Honestly, this color is so pretty. I could wear it by its own. I can wear it on its own. Like this, the cute little lip gloss. That's it. You don't have to apply a lot either. It's so creamy. Oh my gosh. See how it just like melts into my lips? I love that. Yeah, she has that same sweet scent as the um, setting spray. It's so pretty. Like if I just did this and added a little bit of gloss. This is like a cream. It's a matte lipstick, but it is so creamy. Mm-hmm. Yep, this is just so nice. It's real pretty. I could even do a darker lip liner on it and it would just like, it would really pop. I just wanted it to be a little bit more neutral. And yeah, this is it you guys. This is the finished face up, up close, up close and personal. Like you can still see some texture which is fine for me, but like, it still looks extremely put together and my skin, but so much better. Like, yeah, if I put you guys like directly here, just look at the glow. Like, look at that. Oh, she is glass, okay? Like, full on glass. And with a little bit of a lower light, you guys can still see it. 
the shadows on my face, but it's fine. I'm gonna make sure that I show you guys what this looks like in actual natural lighting. Um, it's just like really gloomy outside, so I had to give you guys a lot of light. But either way, I love the products. I love what Rare Beauty stands for. I, I'm an Alex Russo fan, um, but you know, I don't care if you're a celebrity or not. Like, if you come up with a makeup line and it works and there's not glass shards and mold in it, then I'm fine. Like, I'm happy. And this, everything is so pretty, so nice. Um, it, nothing feels heavy. I, which is bad for me because if it feels heavy on my face, I'm not going to touch my face because I don't feel anything. I'm going to be like, ah, I am a rare beauty stand now. Like I see the hype. I'm so, so glad I got these products. These are just perfect. They're phenomenal. They're everything you need. I feel like they're going to last a really long time, except for this one. I'm going to go buy another one of these because the spray is just so nice. So yeah i'm for it i love it thank you guys so 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 much for watching um first makeup review of the year okay i'm gonna definitely give it a 10 out of 10 okay 10 out of 10 recommend like go pick you guys some up but not before i get some more <laughs> but again thank you guys for watching i love you all so much and i will see you in my next time it's so gloomy outside but this is what the face is looking like. Here's the chest. There's nothing on my chest. Face to chest. I know the other lighting. Again, it's gloomy, so setup is crazy. But here is my face. Isn't it just... It's so gorgeous. I know in certain lighting it looked a lot more extreme. First of all... Ooh when the sun in the clouds hits the face here we are but yeah it's not as extreme as it was looking in my room um but yeah is this not like the prettiest this isn't just natural lighting just around my house again it looks very pretty very um very natural it's my skin but just a little just a smidgen better it doesn't look like i did the most i just look very put together i could go to the store looking like this i can go to the mall looking like this i can go to church looking like this um even with the lips even the lips look so natural like this could be my natural lip color um and you would never know that i'm wearing lip liner and lipstick like you just wouldn't know like everything blends nicely looks nicely i'm nice and highlighted this is gonna stay for a, quite a bit because again i use um concealer most of the time i don't usually use foundation unless i have to really go somewhere but just so pretty so soft i love it my eye is running yet again okay and this is in my bathroom um with all the overhead lights on and again just really natural really pretty um full-on matches everything yeah i <sighs> i'm team rare beauty like i might even like this more than Venti.